Judge Van Ruyen said they were between two counties that could potentially take over the trial, but the decision came down to Monterey County. Two and a half hours after Wednesday's hearing was scheduled to begin, Judge Craig Van Ruyen announced the trial for Paul and Ruben Flores is moving to Monterey County, a courthouse 142 miles north of San Luis Obispo. The motion for a change of venue filed by the defense was granted on March 30th. A change of venue is a fairly uncommon request. According to the Judicial Council of California, between 2019 and 2021, there were only five petitions for a change of venue. It is thought that the case is too well known that, that the citizens of that community have preformed opinions, whether it's because of something they heard at, on the news or something they heard at work or church or school. Um, that, that the case is just well known here, people have heard about it, people have thought about it, and have some kind of opinion about it before the case even begins in court. In the case of Kristen Smart's murder back in 1996, billboards, fundraisers, and memorials have contributed to keeping the case in people's minds. The defense attorney argued San Luis Obispo County would not be a place for a fair trial, and Judge Van Ruyen agreed. The last time a trial was moved to another county was the case of Rex Cribs, convicted convicted of raping and killing two San Luis Obispo College students in 1998 and 1999. That case was also sent to Monterey County. As for what's next... The transferring county, San Luis Obispo, is responsible for sending a bench officer or judge with the case to be heard in the receiving county. That could be Judge Van Royen, who's currently appointed to the case, but it could also be another one of our local judges. And a third option is that this county can request that the Office of the Chief Justice of California appoint uh, an unrelated judge. Judge Van Ruyen said details for a date, time and courtroom are in the works with the presiding judge in Monterey County and are expected to be announced next week. Defense attorney Robert Sanger also filed paperwork to request the release of soil samples to counsel ahead of the trial. I reached out to the attorney representing the Smart family and I was told over the phone that for now they do not have a comment on the change of venue. In San Luis Obispo, Claudia Busio, KSBY News. A pretrial conference via Zoom is scheduled for next Monday. The case will now be heard in a courtroom in Salinas, the county seat for Monterey. Monterey County Superior Court Executive Officer Chris Rule reacted today to the high profile trial now under his supervision. The Salinas Courthouse is the courthouse where we can accommodate the large numbers of jurors that I anticipate we'll need to bring here. And so, but you know, the decision about which courtroom this is held in, which judge presides, that all remains to be seen. The main factors that contributed to his decision were the years of publicity the case has had and the county's size.